Hi, this is Heather with Keep It Simple Social Media. And Catherine, my business partner, and I have been talking a lot about video. And as you know, if you're following us, for the next 30 days, we are doing a video a day. Now, the interesting thing about shooting a video a day is we're going to see if the metrics really add up for the amount of work that it is because they say that the more video you shoot the further your reach is going to get and thereby the more audience you will build and the more people will want to trust you and want to follow you in order to understand what it is your products and services are. So we're doing a video a day. So I wanted to talk to you about your own Facebook business page and about video. So number one, we want to always upload our video, what's known as native in Facebook. And that means we're not using a third party app such as let's say YouTube. You can always upload your YouTube after you've finished with it on Facebook and thereby increasing your library on YouTube. But when you create videos on Facebook, you actually get a video library and that's very similar to YouTube. So if there's over 13 billion videos being watched every day on social media, we know that almost 8 billion are on Facebook. The other thing that we know is Facebook is creating a second news feed which possibly is going to be all video. They say that our advertising news feeds are filling up and they're now looking for new ways to do it. And you might have noticed all the changes on Facebook when it comes to Facebook Messenger and so forth. But I want to show you something really interesting. I'm going to pop over to one of our Facebook business pages that we manage, which is torontoism.com. And if I go into their video library, and we are heading over there right now, here we go. You will notice that they have a featured video. This feature video is one that you can keep there for as long as you want or you can change it up every week. The next thing is they have got a number of videos within their library and you can see that their top videos that have been watched 20,000 times, uh, a thousand times, so on, so forth, 6,000 you can see that consumers are loving video because these videos have more than a three second watch. So if I click show more, you can see that their video library is actually growing. Every time that they post a video, they are increasing their social footprint on the World Wide Web. Now, the other thing that I wanted to show you, besides the fact that you now have a video library on Facebook, is if you go into your Insights tab located just above your cover image, you will notice that your overall metrics, and it can be seven days or you can look at 28 days, such as I've just done by clicking uh, the little drop down arrow there, you can see the number of video views over a period of time. And if you scroll down, you can open up to a video. Now I just posted this video probably a couple of hours ago. And you can see that already we've had over half an hour of minutes viewed on this video. It's had 127 people involved. They've watched it for more than 10 seconds. And you have to remember that most people are up to three seconds to count as a video view. And then Facebook is going to give you more metrics when you click on the word post and you can see how many people are doing more than one action. Now this is a video actually that I just shot. So if we wanted to look at something that's been on a little bit longer, you would have to scroll through your news feed and then you would find your video and here's some pretty interesting metrics and they're very favorable uh, in for this property in particular. You can see what your reach is and your video views are almost 50%. Now it is said that the future is video 
And I'm hoping that you yourself are thinking that it's time for you to start utilizing video for your business because the consumer loves video. It's easy to watch. We do know that the consumer does not like sound on the video. Even though I am uh, recording right now with sound, I am going to do subtitles over the sound as well. I hope that this little introduction doesn't overwhelm you, but helps you understand how important it is for you to start using video in your marketing on social media. My name is Heather, my business partner is Catherine, and our motto is let's keep it simple.